first of all, I must put on record that I've triggered the necessary processes, the constitutional processes, that would ensure that if these judges are guilty, they are properly dealt with in accordance with the law. And I had triggered the process. So my commitment as a Ghanaian is first to the constitution. My second commitment, and perhaps most important commitment, is to the people of Ghana. And the work I did is for the people of Ghana. I trust in what I did, and I felt that it would be unfair to keep that information to myself. And so that's why I made it public. I am very, very confident of the investigations that I have done. You see, judges are like gods in the guise of men. You see, they are our last resort. If anything happens, everybody's last resort is the law court. And I, I have done a lot of investigation across the African continent. And I think that Africa's been the problems you're suffering in Africa is as a result of the problems you have with our judiciary. And that if we will be courageous enough to stand toe to toe to investigate some of these issues in our judiciary, I'm sure that Africans can only have a better life. Talking about Anasis, this mask you're wearing all the time has become symbolic now in Ghana where you find a lot of people wearing this mask and saying they are Anas. Can, you, can we see your face? Why can't we see your face? Well, I, I really want to see your face. Over the years, I've had this symbol on. And I usually don't take it out. Because it helps when it comes to my anonymity. Are you ready to see my face? I'm sure we, we really want to see your face. So, I'm going to do it gradually. So, this is my heart, and then I take off, I'm taking off my heart, my beads, everything. And so for those who want to see my face, this is my face. This is how, this is an ass. You said you wanted to see my face. So I have given you my face. So you see, you never know what you are going to find. For me, the important thing is focus. It's not about masking an ass. It's about all of us putting our hands together and ensuring that we have a better continent. I think that anonymity has always been my secret weapon and I have always used it to the benefit of society.